want to know how transaction propagation works in spring boot let me break it down in 60 seconds propagation defines how a transaction behave when one method calls another should it join the existing transaction or should it create a new one we have multiple propagations and let's understand them one by one first is required it joins the existing transaction but will create a new one if none exist then we have requires new this always creates a new transaction supports also joins the existing transaction but unlike required it runs non transactionally if none exist not supported suspends the existing transaction but unlike requires new it does not create a new one it runs non transactionally then we have never it throws an exception if a transaction exist otherwise it runs non transactionally mandatory throws an exception if a transaction does not exist otherwise joins the transaction for a complete hands on experience check out the detailed youtube video